Hey farmers, what's going on? Welcome back to another Hey Dave video. And now in this video, we're gonna be talking about one of the new derbies that we've got by the latest update called as the Chill Derby. So you guys can see my beautiful lilies that um, I've planted. I'm just gonna harvest them. They look so cute and they just make me wanna feel like the spring, the blossom. They look really, really pretty. And I'm just gonna plant them once again. Then I will be selling them because that is what I usually do when I get the new crop in the game. I plant a lot of them and then I sell them to make coins because I know a lot of people are looking for these crops right now. So we're just going to plant them. They only take one hour in 30 minutes. So we are going to see how this derby works. All right, we can see over here a new derby has started. It's called as the Chill Derby. Now, over here you can see there are... Um, 12 tasks, so I can basically cannot trash them. You can see daily tasks 5 over 5. It says pick a task on the left and tap the task button to start it. But before, we are just going to read some rules that it has. So there's no competition. Task stacks available for 24 hours. All tasks are easy. Um, ta stake con stack contains 5 of the same tasks. Once the task is completed or trashed from the player's hand, it returns to the stack and may be taken again. Cool. There are more harsh rewards and there's no link demotion or promotion. So all the things that you guys already know. Now, there are easy tasks, right? So which task am I going to take? Let's go with the current task. Seems like that is the simple one. So this is only um, 61 corns for 22 hours and 17 minutes. And I feel like it's an easy task. You can see there's only 50 points task. So there, there will be no more points task. Only 50 is the maximum, I think so. All right, let's just take the corn task. Wait a minute. This is gonna take a long time now because I have already planted the white lilies. That's not cool. And I think I don't have any corn. That is not cool. Let's get to the paper and get some corn to start the task. It's going to take more time now. I should not have planted the white lilies. I didn't notice. But anyways, let's get more corn. Wow, that's cool. Let's see if we can get any more corn. And I hope you guys are enjoying the new update um, because I am. I'm harvesting, planting, and selling the new crops. Um, I did my decoration. This tree it looks really beautiful as well. I cannot do any more because I don't have any vouchers. Yeah, so we are just going to see how much I can do this now. Um, I did a mistake actually. I just planted wild lilies before. Now the tasks are random. You can see there's um, sugar cane task. Produce four of these rustic bouquets. Have I produced any? No. And we shall see that what happens when you complete the task. So let's go to the horses. Wow, basically this does not show any kind of like neighborhood. So it probably shows us the players that we have. So if we go over here in the, you can see it's similar to the before. And then you can see all the horses that you need to run. Then it shows your neighbors, first, second, and third. I don't really know what does that mean. So yeah, there's no competition and your champion league leaderboard will be stopped. So don't you worry, there will be no league demotion or promotion. Just chill, relax, and play. I know people can do this really fast because, for example, the current task that takes a little bit of time. And it's so simple. Then you've got only to serve two, uh, that's the town task. You've got your three syrup tasks and you've got your egg and beacons tasks. So I think the tasks are actually random. So if you have a look at the horseshoes, we can see there's one, two, three, four, five, wait, 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 what? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Holy cow, that is a lot. So you're basically getting 15 rewards from this derby. Wow. And in this derby, you guys can complete five tasks in a day or you can um, take an extra task by two diamonds, by spending two diamonds, so which means that a single person can do 30 tasks in six days, which means that in a single day, you can only do 250 points, so in six days, you will be able to do 
All right, guys, and if you have a look at the statics of this derby, this shows that in a day you can complete only five tasks by 50 points. So which means that 250 points per day are 300 if you're willing to spend two diamonds to do an extra task. Now, if you can do 250 points in a single day, which means in six days you can collect 1,500 points or 1,800 maximum points if you're using two diamonds. And then, and in a neighborhood where 30 people are playing derby, they will be able to collect 45,000 maximum points or 54,000 if all of them spend diamonds. Now, it takes two diamonds in a single day to do an extra task, which means for six days, it would be like 12 diamonds, which is two more than the usual derby. Because in normal derbies, what you do, basically, you take an extra task after the ninth task, and that it costs you 10 diamonds to do the 10th task. Now, let's have a look at the derby board and have a look. We can see someone's already completed um, a task and got 50 points. So now, if you have a closed look, over here, you can notice the corn task says three over five, which means that I'm doing one and the other corn task, that's my neighbor doing it. So basically this shows three over five and you can take the similar task again and again. And when you complete that task, it goes back again on the board. So let me just have a look over here. What does it show? Okay. And so if you have a look at the hard shoes in this derby, our challenge is 26,463 points. Um, and then we can unlock 15 horses. So I think it's different from all the neighborhoods for all the derbies that people are playing. And now if you have a look in this derby, the tasks are different here. So it shows harvest pumpkins, um, that's production task, cinema task. Um, that's again a production task. You can see there are a lot of town tasks. And if you have a look here, you can see that uh, one of my neighbor is doing the harvest task. And the board shows four over five. So in this neighborhood, there are only two people. And if you have a look over here, we can see the maximum points that we have to collect are 2,970. So in this derby, basically, there is no difference between the leagues. If you're in champion leagues or if you are in novice league and professional league, it does not matter. You will get the same horseshoe, total 15 horseshoe rewards, but the points will be different according to the members that are playing this derby. And and if we have a close look over here, we can see there's nothing that's going on. It's only us. And I think it's really good for the people who just like to kind of relax and just chill around. And in here, you can see there are different tasks. You've got the animal task, harvest task. So the tasks will be random for everybody around. Some will be getting easy tasks. Others might get a little bit um, difficult tasks. For example, the harvest tasks These are kind of hard to do. And you can see the neighbors are doing the tasks. So they are doing the feeding task, the sugar cane, and the sugar cane again. So you can see Two of my neighbors are doing the same task. You can do that too. So if you have a look at the, um, the sugar cane task, it says that three over five, which means that two people are already doing it. Three can take it more and I can do this if I want to. Then you can see the strawberry task. So if you have a look over here, the horse, it's gonna run, let's see. And we've completed 200 points. All right, so. Now, if I have a look at my neighborhood, the total 27 people that are playing this chill derby. So you can see the green farm and gypsies are getting farm. They've already completed one task with 50 points. So the tasks will be no lower, no higher. You will have to complete these anyways. You cannot trash them. They will be right there. So these are like 50 point tasks. So to do a little bit of mathematics, if there are 27 people playing derby in my neighborhood, if they complete 250 points per day, we all can actually get 6,750 points total in a single day if we all complete our five tasks, which means that in six days, we can collect 40,500 points in total. So it all depends on how many people are playing this derby in your neighborhood and the harsher rewards will also be according to that. So just chill and play this derby. Now, in a single day, if you can get over 6,000 points, which means we can get one, two, three, four, five, six hard shoes we can get in a single day. And we can complete all of the hard shoes just in four days. So we will have like two extra days. 
And I think there's no need to spend diamonds in this derby because there's no competition. It's only you and your neighbors that are playing together. Um, and you're also getting all the harsh rewards if you complete all the five tasks. So I don't really think there's any need to spend two diamonds to do an extra task. Now, I'm going to complete my corn task, which was to harvest 61 um, corns. And there you go. I've got 50 points as well. And we have got 150. Now, what's going to happen? Let's have a look. All right. So the corn task is back on the board again. You can see five or five. So anyway takes tests I mean I guess that's really cool so I'm just gonna do this once again let's do all right and we are just going to do that once again let's do this I got an X which is cool so probably this means that I can complete all of the actual current tasks or I can do other ones as well but let's see what happens so I'm just gonna wait till my coin grows now here you guys can see that the stacks of tasks are changing 4 over 5, 4 over 5. You can see the bed and breakfast is 2 over 5, which means almost 3 people are doing it. Um, yeah, you can see um, Katie's Gypsy and Katie's Place and Farm Fresh, they are actually doing these bed and breakfast tasks. And I am doing my corn test, it's really good. The tasks will go back to the board and you can take them over and over again. Okay, so over here. All right, let's spin the Wheel of Fortune. And we can see we have the Gracious Brigade in here as well. So maybe that's what we're going to get in this Wheel of Fortune. Let's see what we get. Okay, no, 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 but I've got an no dip. I missed that Brigade though. Okay guys, so I'm about to complete my coin task and there we go, 50 points again. So yeah, we have collected, I guess, 350. Wow, we're, we're close. We're doing pretty well. Um, I have done two tasks and now the coin task is back on the board again. Let's take the serve two times during the bed and breakfast. I'm going to take this town building task now. And you guys see it shows one now, which means that only one person can take this task more. So let's get to my town and complete this event. I mean task, not the event. All right, we're back into my town. It's gonna, we, I do have some ready. Wow, boom, completed it in seconds. That's so cool. Now I know a lot of people are gonna find this derby a little bit boring, especially those people who play competitively and you know, just they're like the big derby players. But I like it. And the best thing that I'm liking about this derby are the more rewards. So 15 harsh rewards, which is cool. All right, you guys, I have completed three tasks now and two more to go. Let's see what I can do now. Seems like I'm going to take the card again because that's easy. I don't want to take any production tasks. They take a lot of time. Let's just do a little bit of harvesting. And I think I am going to be doing all five tasks right here in this video. And I think that'd be really cool. So I've just planted it. All right, guys, so I've completed another current task. There we go. And the daily tasks won. Let's do another current task. And boom. Now I cannot do any more. You can see it says daily task zero. Um, daily quota, you may add one task when your quota runs out. Your daily quota re resets in 13 hours in 13 minutes. So you can see the time from here. Let's complete this task now.